It's a great shot. That is a magnificent shot from Sewag. And he's just watching it crawl over the boundary. First boundary of the match. And it comes off the blade of Sewag. It's seven for no wicket after the first. On the terraces. It's a big thumping blow by Sewag. He has muscled that for four. Well, he's just manufactured that stroke within the Sewag. Wasn't right up there in the slot. It was a good length delivery. Have a look at this. Unleashes the par, the butcher from Delhi. Superb stroke, straight as a ramrod. Not a soul moves. Bang. Four more. Down the pitch he goes, Siwag, and he's just taking a fancy now to the left arm bowling of Islam. Well, he's cutting loose within the Siwag. Feet of Quicksilver, once again, straight as a candle. Have a look at this. He will decimate and annihilate you as a bowler. Tent your psyche. Nothing wrong that the bowler has done. A good X speak for themselves. He's worth his weight in gold within the Sehwag. What an asset. He's on 18 and a total of 28. It's a good looking stroke. That is going to race away fast outfield and he has guided that through for four. Well, he's flowing like a rampant river within the Sewa. Caress that through the cover boundary. Pick the gap. Minimum of fuss. Maximum result. Touch of class. Oozing with confidence. Beginning to flow. Ominous signs for Bangladesh. And again, a lovely looking stroke from Sewag. He really has now started to step on the accelerator. Problems. A direct hit was what was required. So a lot of flights uh, from Singapore and the Far East are not uh, really taking off. Easy runs there for within the Sehwag on the pads uh, once again uh, with no protection. It's just a matter of him getting a bit of bat onto it and he'll get some runs. That brings a 50 up for India. Well, that's a fine shot. Plenty of work with the bottom hand. It's a risky stroke from Sehwag to punch him another boundary. Hardly uh, played any shots on the offside. Everything he's worked uh, to the onside, and as Ravi Shastri said, making good use of the bottom hand. The ball uh, would have perhaps gone towards uh, the middle of the stumps. That's another boundary on the onside. This is poor bowling. Once again, drifting on to leg stump, and he pays the price for it. It's a terrific shot from uh, Virinder Sevar. The ball's come into him and he's used the movement and his wrist quite superbly. There it is. Look at that. He's hit it really with great power. He's given it an almighty punch. Makes you wonder why bowlers having bowled a good ball the previous delivery and knowing that that is a line to ball straight on the pads. That's four more. That's a lovely shot. He just waited on it. And he's found the boundary again. That's the third boundary of the over. Once again, the bottom hand coming into play for the square cut. Width offered and taken with a smile on his face by Virinder Sehwag. That's picked away. It's gone all the way. What a way to bring up a 50 for Virinder Sevak. And it's come in very quick time. Of just 44 balls. This is a terrific shot. Great way to bring up his half century. 
Ball sliding into the pads once again. So just uh, 44 balls, nine boundaries and a six. 18 runs coming off that last over. 12 gone, it's 71 for one. That's four more. Loose delivery. Wide and Sevak takes toll of it. Again, a good over for India. Ten runs coming off it. Ah! He's given him. Now, Mohamed Rafiq's not a big turner of the ball. That must have uh, weighed in the umpire's mind as well. I'm just wondering if he didn't just play down the wrong line. He does like to play leg side. Let's have a look. It's coming in quite a bit. Pitches now. It's got to turn back. And he's got forward as well. He's hitting him on a line. I guess you've got to say, where was it going? Not too very much. Doubt there. Big appeal. And a big wicket. So that's Rinasiri gone. 63. And then he loses the second wicket. Maybe two for two.